God cannot speak to nobody. I'm sure of that, and I can swear with my life. Hi guys, my name is Sixtus Kore. They call me Rabbi Raboni, the Unshockable Shocker, the Untrackable Tracker. This is Bread of Life. Pastor William Kumuyi of Deeper Life. Pastor E.A. Adeboyo of Redeemed. Pastor Bishop David Oedebo of Winners and other big, big Pentecostal men of God, especially from Yoruba land, are playing safe with this next, in the next coming election. That is why they up to now, they haven't thrown their full support behind Obi. Why? Because they don't want to fall out with Tinibu, who is their client's man, can, um, um, client's man or king's man from Yoruba land. And who, when he was governor, gave them a comfortable environment to move, do their ministry. They don't also want to openly support Tinibu or Atiku because they don't want to fall out with Indibo in their church. Indibo make 75 to 80% of the population in Pentecostal churches. Those churches owned by Yoruba men. Yes, Igbos. And Igbos are the highest tithe givers. And seed sowers. Why? Because in the Bojego, kochi kochi, in the Boji money. So they are trying to play safe. That is why Pastor Kumu said that he hasn't heard from God about who is going to be the next president. Wait, I thought God's work was to take us to heaven. How has he changed businesses and he's now helping nations elect leaders? In Nigeria, we don't elect leaders by voting. Uh -uh. We wait for men of God to proclaim the anointed one. So, God has started looking into politics. In Nigeria, B, no problem. So, in 2015, was it God that gave us the Buhari? Because I remember then, some men of God were supporting Buhari, while others were supporting um, Jonathan. So, who gave us Buhari? God. So, this condition we are, we are in now is God that gave us the the condition okay if god didn't give us buari now why did god stay there and satan gave us buari so these are the questions we need to ask ourselves so if god is really talking to some people why are we suffering why is the dollar getting to 1000 naira against the naira what is happening if we will serve god and hear from his leaders we should not make mistakes to elect bad leaders no, we should have credible leaders because we deserve it. Because we serve a living God. Who and who are hearing from God? And what is God telling them? Please, let us understand and know who we are listening to. I said in my post that God didn't, will not, cannot, and can never speak to anybody. Nobody is hearing from anybody. Everybody is talking out of the figment of their imaginations. Everybody, everybody is just talking the way his spirit or his conscience or his heart or whatever his brain is telling him. Nobody is hearing from anybody. Now, I'm not saying your man of God must proclaim P2B as president. Mm -mm. Even those who have proclaimed him as president, who have invited him to his church, like Paul and Enche in Abuja, is also playing safe. Same because of Indi Igbo. Nobody, people are very careful not to hurt in the Igbo. That is why they are supporting P2B. Now, and do not ever think that your men of God want the country to be fine. Eh? Your jet flying men of God, unless the, the other type of men of God that were deceived. The ones that came to deceived don't want the country to be good. Why? Because if the country is any, let me explain it, any tight collecting man of God, any seed sowing man of God, any whatever church he is, don't want doesn't want the country to be better. Why? Because Allah de Hima will in Denze. If the country gets better, people will stop going to church. Go to UK and go to America and see how many go to church. If it's not old people and also black people. The, your 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 tight jet tight collecting jet flying men of God don't want the country to be fine. Why? Because if you get if you have a job, you're not gonna go to church again. To pray for job, if you can, if our if our if our passport is good and you can apply for a visa to any good country, you're not going to pray for a visa. If our health facilities are good, our hospitals are good, you're not going to pray for um for good health. 
and if our roads are good, you are going to you are not going to pray against accidents. Uh -uh. If our education system is good, you go, you're going to you're going to pray for exam success. Ex uh -uh. You're going to study and go for exams and pass your exams. So they are benefiting and place by now in the kind of suffering we are suffering men of god should have come out and tell us who god has ordained to it must be people to be eh, but who god has ordained to be the leader that will lead us from out of the suffering if we have god why are we suffering so who says the will of god how can it be the will of god for his children to suffer how can a father say he loves his children and allow them to suffer and allow people come to the church and shoot at them that is not love. That is hatred. Don't always think that God can only show himself when he kills unbelievers or make them blind or deaf. Uh -uh. He should show himself by making Nigeria the best country in the world because we serve him more than any, any other person. Thank you.